<laughs> Hello, and welcome to this podcast. Uh, if Orshka looks a little bit different, it's because this isn't Orshka. Uh, this is Mia. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Mia. Hi. Hello. Mia is our newest coach in the Bella Beat uh, application, and you can also find her in Period Diary. And she's basically leading you all through all of these wonderful follow along Pilates routines. You may have seen them already, and if you haven't, please check them out. She has put so much work into them, and so has the team. They are wonderful. You will sweat. You will burn. Ooh. I don't know if that's a good love thing. The, love the word burn. <laughs> but it works. Hey. Yeah. Well, Mia, welcome. Thank you for coming Thank today. You. Thank you for having me here. Of it's course. amazing. I love it here. <laughs> well, let's just start off from the top. Pilates. What are they? <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, uh, yeah, go ahead. Take it from the top. Introduce yourself. Yeah. So, hi, everyone. I'm Mia. So, as my a beautiful Melanie here said, <laughs> um, yeah, I'm a Pilates coach and have been for two and a half, three years. Uh, yeah, I got my certificates two and a half years ago. Great. And yeah, have been a happy Pilates coach since then. That's awesome. You're basically living yeah. the dream. Like you're living the housewife dream. I know. <laughs> I know. I love it. At, at the beginning, like it wasn't like that wasn't my, you know, that wasn't like my goal, my oh, really? plan. But now it turns out to be an amazing goal. Awesome. <laughs> so if anyone's waiting to be a Pilates coach, feel free to do it. Yeah. Well, what got you into Pilates in the first place? Like, I mean, you could do anything and you chose Pilates. Yeah, well, to be honest, like I... Um, at the, like when I was younger, so mm -hmm. I'm starting from when I was younger, but it has a certain point when I'm talking <laughs> about it. But yeah, um, when I was younger, um, I wasn't like as much into fitness mm -hmm. as I am now. I used to dance a lot, so you know, like okay. jazz dance, ballet, and whatever, like in primary school and high school. Yeah. But um, yeah, I was never really into fitness. I was always, always into biology. So like mm -hmm. my goal was always to become a doctor. I have a doctor in a family, and it was always for me like you know, being a doctor, like human body, physiognomy, that was something cool. that like, yeah, that was like, I was really, really attracted to. And then, you know, like life writes its own tales. Life happens, uh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, and yeah, like my med school, I don't know, like I decided not to do it. Mm -hmm. And I was studying economics at the point uh, in English. And this is, I think, where, I, where my like, focus where like my life changed so you know, I had a lot more time like to focus on myself like do a lot of things besides you know when you're in high school you basically come from from school yep. like do your homework or maybe go out to the club but <laughs> still go. you know like these are your biggest worries um, but yeah when I was in uni I had like a lot of time to like practice and train and this is where like my love for fitness especially oh, for cool. Pilates happened yeah and usually um, most people don't fall in love with fitness in college like I know I I know. Absolutely, was not into fitness. I was into yeah. drinking, skipping class, well, sleeping girl, that's in, also good. chicken nuggets. That's know? also good, you know. And fitness was like on the bottom of it. So good for it's you. Also that's part, so yeah. healthy. Yeah. yeah, but I, I mean, I was also like surprised to find like yeah. that I love this, you know, because <laughs> like high school was all like partying and whatever. Yeah. Um, and yeah, and then when I moved to Vienna, like this is where we like clicked Pilates, and yeah. yeah and this was Aww. like love happened and I was like this is maybe this is my goal and like why Aww. why I told the story well when I was younger <laughs> it's because I think like I loved medicine I always mm -hmm. loved it in like mid school and I still love hearing about it but I don't know like at the end I'm also working with like human bodies and mm -hmm. everything so it's you know it kind of like made sense cool. and you're end. also yeah. essentially healing the body as well like, it really is through fitness yeah. yeah you know like That's really cool yeah I feel like people like nowadays realize what like fitness especially Pilates you know is good for yeah absolutely yeah um so yeah I really love my job I love it Aww. and it's not even my job it's like part of my life so yeah. That's really cool. Can't really say. Can't complain. They always say, like, find something you love to do and you'll never work a day in your life. So It's true. <laughs> like, when I was younger, you know, like, parents used to tell you, you have to do what you love. And, you mm -hmm. know, when I was younger, I was like, I mean, what are these people talking about? Like, just give me money. Just give me money. Just, like, you know. <laughs> let me live my life. Leave me yeah. alone. Yeah. But, like, now, because I went to Vienna basically to study my master's. So I studied oh, wow. quantitative finance. Oh, wow. And, you know, it's all numbers and it's all programming. And I was it's like. flex there. I, <laughs> like, I mean, on. I love that. It. But you know the thing is, I could do it. I like it was you know it was difficult. Mm -hmm. But in the end, like now that I do this, like now I realize that like everything that I was doing before, even though I thought I did it like 100%, now I realize that I just like did it you know 70%. And you mm -hmm. know when you actually do something that you love, Aww. yeah, that's really. 
awesome. I'm in love with my job. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be jealous. I could talk yeah. about it the whole day. <laughs> oh, you yeah. mentioned you yeah. had certificates yeah. in Pilates. So yeah. what So what was your training into like becoming a coach? How did that? So uh, this happened when I moved to Vienna. Mm-hmm. So as I said, I was studying a very intensive master's <laughs> course. Yeah. yeah. When and you have the word need... quantitative in your like major, like, that is intense to me. Like, I know. I was like... <laughs> Did I need this? <laughs> maybe. I did, but I did. Yeah. Want to date Pilates now. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. But if I hadn't done it, maybe, you know, maybe this wouldn't have happened. So, so since I was, you know, studying so hard, I needed a break. Mm-hmm. And I was, yeah, I was living in Vienna. And then I discovered at the time, uh, there was a documentary on Netflix about yeah. Bikram. Oh, yeah. And then I Googled, like, Bikram Studios. Like, Bikram mm-hmm. Yoga. I don't know how familiar people are with it. Yeah. But it's a hot yoga. It's very intense, but very good. Um, and yeah, I was like, maybe I should try it. And there was the studio, so like two streets from me. Hello, mm-hmm. baby girl. <laughs> and I was like, they had hot Pilates. Yeah. And this is the first like class that I took. Oh, cool. And I came there and I was like, wow. At the beginning, I was like, okay, you know, it's hot. It's humid. It's hot, <laughs> but in the end, I was like, oh my God, what just happened? Yeah. This is so amazing. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, then love happened. And I was like, I had to like find out everything about it. Mm-hmm. And I did my... Um, uh, training, so I had two trainings, so, um, yeah, it was, like, level one and level two. Right. And I did them, I think, in a period of, like, six months. Okay. And wow. then, yeah. And That's pretty intensive, though. Yeah, yeah. It was nice. It was, I was, um, t- I was, like, practicing, mm-hmm. but the whole course was, I think, like, probably, like, a week or so. Okay. But then, like, it takes you, like, time to, like, practice and to know, like, all the cues, the workouts, the muscles, everything. Yeah. Um, Yeah. And yeah. then, yeah, now I've been a happy Pilates teacher. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, for two and a half years. I mean, I've been using amazing. your Pilates programs in the app already, and yeah. a lot of people have been using them, and we've been getting wonderful feedback about it, which oh, is awesome. So nice to um, hear. But it's really I love the burn. It's mm. love and the burn. Come on, mm. party people! Mm. <laughs> like I love when I hear it. Party I'm like, people, like it kills me, but also mm. I'm like, oh, I'm a party yeah. person. I'm a party exactly. person. I can do oh. it. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> but it's really awesome because I love that you're so like you're so focused on mm. what you're doing, but you're also focused on like you know you mentioned things yeah. and yes it's a follow along and so it's very different than being mm. in person but you mentioned things you're like and if you feel this right here in this body in your glutes like you're doing it right and I'm like yeah I am feeling it in my glutes I am doing it right you know and like you just you're so it's you're so intuitive oh, thank like you. with everything and like just you <laughs> yeah. it seems like you know you've been doing this you know you said for two years yeah. three years almost yeah. and like you already know you already spot like you know what people struggle with or yeah. you know if people do it right or wrong and I, I mean I just assume that all comes yeah, from the training you, know, you did exactly like um I used to tr- like train a lot as a student and yeah. even when I was like a student in a class and when I was there, I used to, like, pay attention a lot to my teachers, like, what they said, you know, okay. um, like, what's the muscle groups that you're using. And mm-hmm. it made it a lot easier when I became a teacher, you know, to explain it to people. That's true. Because, yeah. like, when you when you work out, you also, like, want to focus on this exact muscle. And then when you, like, explain it to people, then they understand and they feel a bit engaged. So, you know, it's, yeah, it's a nice, it's, it's cool. yeah. It's like a mental and physical it is. engagement. Because it is, you know, yeah. like, you you understand what you're doing. Exactly. That's so important. Yeah, yeah it is. It <laughs> truly is. Because, yeah. you know, you see people in the gym especially, mm-hmm. like, doing some things. I'm not an expert. I'm not an expert. But um, I see people, like, doing wrong things. And I'm mm-hmm. like, just stop. Just stop. Please. Yeah. You're going to hurt yourself. Please don't hurt yourself. Yeah. Hurt yourself. You want to get yeah. stronger, yeah. you know? Yeah, not weaker. Oh. Um so real yeah. quick, upper body, lower body, mm. core, legs, booty. Which one is your absolute favorite? Like whenever you're doing, ooh. or full body. There we go. There's like six. Ooh, ooh, ooh. this is a tough yeah. one. So I think my favorite could be like core. <gasps> okay, okay. Yeah, I love a good core workout yeah. because it like you can experiment a lot. Mm-hmm. You can work with different weights, mm-hmm. and like especially with Pilates. Like, Pilates is all about your core. Right. And then, you know, when you do a good core workout, you f- you literally feel, like, after 60 minutes, even, like, 20-minute workout, you literally feel stronger. Yeah, that's Like, true. your back and everything. So, I do love a good, good and core workout. I think a lot workout, of people don't recognize... booty as well, yeah. Yeah, booty is good. I know, it's a difficult <laughs> It's a close one. second, that <laughs> yeah. booty. Yeah. But when you just mentioned the back, um, I think a lot of people really don't realize <clears throat> that when you talk about the core, most mm-hmm. people think just abs. Yeah. But obviously, it does incorporate your back as well. Of and, course. like, a little bit in the spine you know, your upper glutes a little mm. bit as well. So that's... Yeah, because, like, when you when I usually, like, say we have a core day, then people usually think, okay, so we'll do 60 minutes of just, like, crunches or whatever. Yeah. But basically, like, core is 
Yeah, it's a big part of your body. It's the back, it's the, it's whole the muscles, it's your pelvic <laughs> floor. So it's like your inner thighs as well. It's your arms. So yeah, core can be a good hardcore. Work. Hardcore, yeah. <laughs> but this I'm, is a good one. Yeah. I'll use this one in my class. <laughs> <It's awesome>. <laughs> copyright, <laughs> copyright, copyright, Mel. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, so when it comes yeah. to Pilates, mm-hmm. like, you know, I've recently just started dabbling in it because we worked with you. I'm yeah. obsessed. But as a Pilates coach, like, you know, tell us, how has Pilates changed your life? If it has at all. Yeah. I don't know. Because it's... It is. Yeah. It really is. Like, for me, Pilates is a workout. So when I started doing it, I was, yeah, I was living in Vienna at the time. Like, it wasn't, you know, the brightest time of my life. Okay. At the time, I was struggling with the uh, ED. Uh-huh. So, yeah, I was... Mm-hmm. I had, I was diagnosed with anorexia nervosa and at the time, you know, like, um, you're like wow. very confused. You don't know what to do. And, um, but you want to like work your body, want to work out. Yeah. And then when I tried Pilates, this was the first time like why I loved it at the beginning, because when I came to my studio, I remember like after a few classes, um, so this was the room that had mirrors on two sides mm-hmm. and you basically like look at yourself in the mirror the whole time. And at, you know, at the place where I was at, you usually like look at yourself you know, like, oh my God, what do I look like with this, with uh-huh, that? Self-conscious, and then, yeah. yeah. And then at the one time, I remember, I saw all of these people in the room, you know, when you're like dripping sweat and whatever. Yeah. You like, look at all those people and they're all like, like not even looking at themselves or just like, what do I look like? But you literally see it in their, mind, in their eyes, like, oh my God, what's, how strong am I? Like yeah. how, oh, wow. what I can do? So this was, I think, like a big shift, you know, in my, in my mind and, yeah. um, yeah, so, like, Pilates has changed my life a lot. Absolutely. And, um, yeah, you know, like, working with people, it's just, it's amazing. You, you like, you get to meet so many different, like, beautiful women mm-hmm. and men. Yeah. <laughs> of course, and men. Um, but, yeah, it's literally been beautiful, and it has, yeah, yeah it has changed my life a lot. Yeah. Oh, thank you for sharing From being, that. like, yeah. total bookworm, like, yeah. once. <laughs> Quantitative okay, yeah. economics, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now I literally, like, can't be by the, like, laptop more than, like, mm-hmm. three hours a day. Oh, yeah, wow. <laughs> you know. Yeah. It's amazing. Yeah. Thank so you so really much for sharing. It. That's a very personal story. I didn't yeah. realize, like, it was going to be. Because, you know, that, yeah, I feel like a lot of, like, now, you know, working in this industry, you see a lot of girls, a lot of guys, you know, a lot of people having this issue. Mm-hmm. So I feel like now I am like looking at, at it from this point of view. From a sort of healed perspective, yeah. yeah. I'm like not grateful, but I'm proud that I went through that because Absolutely. you know, it built me into the person that I am today. Yeah. You know, it like it's, it's makes it easier for you to see people that are struggling with it. Mm-hmm. And you know, it completely changes your focus. It's not just about, you know, looks, it's not just about like, f- you know, being fit, having abs or whatever. It's just like, you know, feeling good overall. Oh, I love so, that. Yeah. That's yeah. a really beautiful yeah. story. Oh, thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank oh. you. <laughs> thank you, babe. Mm-hmm. Have you been feeling the burn in my classes? Absolutely. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, she also has classes. She has her own studio here mm-hmm. um, in Zagreb, and it's a hot Pilates studio, and I've been going yeah. to those. I feel the burn. I sweat <laughs> so much. Like, just, it's... That's the goal, baby. <laughs> I love it, though. I'm, it's, yeah. I'm almost obsessed with it, in all honesty. Like, I just yeah. love... Like, and you also have the mirrors to, like, watch your form yeah. and stuff. And I'm learning so much more about my body and, like, what mm. it's capable of, what I should work on. You yeah. know, as I had mentioned earlier, um, mm. you know, my hip flexors are yeah. as, like, my right side is so much better than my left. Common thing, yeah. Mm-hmm. I mean, absolutely common. But, like, it's just so interesting to see, you know, where I was when I started. Because yeah. I know when I first started her class. That's so nice. Yeah. I almost passed out, y'all. Like, I straight <laughs> up, you know, she's like, sit down, sit down, put your feet on the wall. And I'm like, no, no, no. Fine, you know, and like just like Gumby body, but no, like yeah. I really almost like passed out, and it was just I was pushing I know, myself too I hard. Know. I wasn't hydrated enough. I was probably hungover and all honesty, <laughs> I know. you know. I know. I remember my first class. Oh my god, I was like, when I came there, I had like light gray leggings, and can oh. I tell you, at the end, and I was like, I was the person to say, and like, I came to my teacher, and like, this is my first class. And then she was like, do you need a bigger towel for your mats? And I was like, no, I don't sweat. <laughs> I don't sweat. Because <laughs> no. I was the person to like not sweat. Can yeah. I tell you? Yeah. I went out. I looked. My, like my leggings were obviously black. Yeah, obviously. But at, the, at <laughs> a certain point when I looked at myself in the mirror and I looked like, 
you know. Wow. I had a weight crop on <laughs> or whatever. Just drenched everywhere. It was just like, yeah. yeah. Um, oh, no. But I do remember my first class. I know it gets intense. Yeah. But then, you know, you get into it. You obviously know now. You get used to it, yeah. And yeah. I, I definitely understand and respect my body so much more. Right. And I know what my strengths are. I know what I need to work on. Nice. But at the end of every class, even if I'm like in your studio or I'm at home doing these Pilates, just following the app. Yeah. Um, the amount of just, you know, like I'm so proud of myself because these yeah. are, it's not easy, you know, like right. it's mm -hmm. just, it's not, it's hard enough to go somewhere and do it or to open your oh, phone and course. do it to of just course. like get in the headspace to work exactly. out. Exactly. But it's one of the most rewarding things that like I can do for myself. That's and nice. I love your energy as well. Like oh, thank in you. person, on the app, like both places, thank I just you. feel the energy and I, <laughs> and I feel really motivated. Thank you. Thank you. And, and I, I really, love <laughs> yeah, I mean, I really love it. You know, like yeah. that's, you know, that's like part of my job and that's just you know who I'm always loved working with people so awesome, I always yeah. love that you know like seeing different energies feeling different energies mm -hmm. is just you know amazing and you know this is what like basically the goal is when you work out you want right. to feel good you yeah. want to like be proud of yourself and you should be because Absolutely. basically you know like it's the time of the day where you can just be like laying on your couch or just like walking your dog yep. but you you know you decided to take this like time for yourself and you should be proud yeah and even like even if you do like 10, 15, 20 minutes, whatever like you can in the day, that's just, you know, that's... It's more than that's doing nothing. Exactly, yeah, exactly. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, I'm so glad so you like it. I love it, yeah. Okay. yeah. <laughs> and for all you guys, like we're absolutely going to have more Pilates going into the app. Um, you know, we have a handful in yeah. there right now, but we've recorded a lot more. So, you know, just yeah. stick around and keep updating or not mm. updating. I mean, you'll just see it when you open the app. But mm. um, <laughs> just like stay tuned and like stay alert, you know, because they're always yeah. going in there. I hope you love it. <laughs> <laughs> um, as far as like benefits of Pilates go, yeah. like, um, you know, what's, let's talk long term. Let's, uh, you know, yeah. let's talk long term here. Of what course, is long -term? you know. Yeah, so what are the long term benefits? You know, uh, yeah. I want to keep at Pilates. Like, what's in it for me, like in the future? So for me, when you look at like whichever workout you pick, okay, so it's Pilates. Like the most long-term benefit that you can get is being consistent. Okay. You know, it's just like if you have consistency, like even if it's just one time a week, if it's two times a week, perfect. Three times, oh my god. Mm -hmm. But um, <laughs> if you have if you have this consistency, hello baby girl. For me, this is like, I think this is like the most important long-term benefit that you can get. Mm -hmm. You know, because as you do it consistently, you'll feel it even more. So the first time, okay, you'll obviously feel the burn, feel the sweat, whatever. You'll probably be sore for three or four days yeah. afterwards. Yeah. You'll be thinking a lot yeah. about me. Yeah. <laughs> but, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, but um, yeah, after a certain like time, you'll feel, you'll feel your body changing, literally. Like I, f I see it in like women, let's say 50 plus mm -hmm. that like really train hard. And you can literally see them, like they've been doing either reformer Pilates or just like regular mat Pilates, mm -hmm. like for years. You literally see it in them, like their posture, their oh, core yeah. is so strong as opposed to like when you look at someone who hasn't been, you know, mm -hmm. like working out. Yeah. Like it's the back, you usually see the back. Like the rounded the shoulders. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I'm so it's like, like now correcting my posture I know, me now. Too. Like, <laughs> I brought know, awareness me too. to it. So. <laughs> but it is, you know. Um, but like with Pilates, you literally get, you know, very conscious about it. Yeah. Um, yeah, it does bring about body awareness. Right? That's really cool. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, I feel like long term benefit that you can get is just like being strong, like having strong the core that mm -hmm. I talked about. It's so important, you know, because yeah. as you get older, your like intercostal muscles are just like your bones. It just, you know, so they lose brittle. their density. Yeah. And, you know, with like working out, you get to like nourish them. It just like feels so strong. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, I feel like long term benefits is just like feeling good yeah, and feeling strong. True. That's good. Yeah. And it's great when you're a sedentary. Yeah. Like, and it's literally like 15 minutes a day. Yeah. And especially yeah, for the sedentary, like for people, most Working people, on a computer all day. It's just yeah. like you see it this so is much. This all day. And yeah, even now, <laughs> like, I see it so, I know, but it's just, you know, it's normal. I know. Because you don't think about it yeah. and then it just like, yeah. you turn into a little ball at the end. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. Yeah. I know it happened to me yeah. as well. Um, but now, you know, like, if you, like, even if you think about it once mm -hmm. during this part, <laughs> That's During amazing. the gremlin transition, yeah. you know, <laughs> exactly. From a, like a little tall, from an elegant tall person. swan. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Even if you think about it once, it's just it's more than enough. Yeah. So yeah, I feel oh. like you know, like getting stronger is 
That's a huge benefit. Yeah, it is. I mean, like you mentioned, like uh, you said, like, you know, especially older women. And I know Pilates is wonderful for women mm. who are perimenopause, menopausal, mm. you know, postmenopause. Um, it's wonderful for them because yeah. it is great for like, you know, not just the muscles, but like, you know, when you talk about bone density and like having like weaker joints and things like that, like yeah. it's so good for that and so, so helpful. Good. Cause you know, Pilates was basically invented as a, like a rehabilitation exercise. That I did not know. Yeah. Okay. So Joseph Pilates created it because to like treat people who had a certain, a certain uh -huh. injuries, especially like athletes. Yeah. So athletes used to like do Pilates to like recover from either like like marathons or just if they had injuries so like this is the way in which you can like work out your body but also you will not be bored I promise you you will Definitely not be bored not. you'll feel the burn um and yeah I think this is like what I love about it recently it has you know people started paying attention to it a lot more mm -hmm. and like even if you do it it's like I have a lot of guys that actually love Pilates that's great, yeah. And, yeah, because, like, before, you used to, like... You think it's mostly women? Women in their yeah. 50s plus. Okay. So this was... I always thought it was young women doing Pilates I don't more. Know, but, like, you're the third person today. Be like, really? no, it's always been, like, older women that were, you like, see? hitting it up. Yeah. Because, like, and I was... I thought about, oh, my God, like, these women, like, if they're 50 plus and they do this, respect, my yeah. God. You know, when you start doing it, you realize that it's... That. it's it's, you know, it's, it's, it's no joke. It's no joke. joke. That's, that's no what joke. I was trying to say. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like, it's no joke. It, it, it's not, yeah. you know, and it's, but it's also like very fun yeah. and it's like no pressure and just like, um, yeah, it's so good for your bones, especially mm -hmm. for your hormones as yeah. well. You know, like it doesn't spark your cortisol mm -hmm. as, as much, um, but it gets your heart rate up. Yeah. So that's it's cool. like. You get the best of both worlds. Kind of brings out a like yeah. nice balance to it. Exactly. Yeah. Best of both worlds. Best of both worlds. Miley's so big right now. She is huge hey. right now. I'm Love loving her. it. Loving Love it. Mm, loving yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to Miley. Come, on, <laughs> Come be on our podcast. Exactly. Yeah. Sing along. <laughs> um, as far as like yeah. uh, Pilates newbies go, mm. uh, if you had like three mm. tips for people just starting out with Pilates, what would those three tips be? Three tips. Yeah. You can also give um, it up to five, you know, but we're going to cap it at 10. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> so, I mean, I can give 20 three. if you yeah. want. I can do, yeah, <laughs> like a whole list. Um, but yeah, well, so first of all, like the burn, the burn will pass, you know, like the burn lasts for one minute, but I'm telling you, it's better to suffer for this like one minute than your whole life. You Ooh, know, like God. doing workout, if it is just for 10 minutes, I promise you it will pay off for another like 10 years, 10 minutes a day. You know, it's for the more next than 10 enough. Years. Yeah, like, so it pays off for 10 years. Yeah, of yeah. course. Of it's course, like when they yeah. say when you smoke, it takes like so many seconds off your life. Pilates is adding those exactly. seconds to your life. So that's pretty So like do Pilates, people. <laughs> yeah, do Pilates people. <laughs> yeah. Come on, party people, Pilates. Yeah. Party. <laughs> party. Um, so yeah, this is... That's also, a good tip. Yeah. yeah. Um, also just like be, take it easy. You know, it's mm -hmm. it takes time. Some workouts, you know, are more difficult. And just like, yeah, be kind to yourself. Don't oh. put any pressure on yourself. Like it will come, everything will come in its, you know, its own time. Mm -hmm. And yeah, just like have fun, enjoy the process, you know, like feel and see your body changing, yeah. like getting stronger and just like, yeah, these are like. That's good tips. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. Just like enjoy it. You know, yeah. it's. Enjoy it. Yeah. yeah. Enjoy yeah, it. it makes trust you happy. yourself and, you know, put time into it. Exactly. So, yeah. Exactly. Oh, yeah. I love that. Thank you. I love that. Thank you. We got that. Yeah, okay. No. <laughs> Um, so yeah. when it comes to like, yeah, you know, you mm. feel the burn for the second, but also like you yeah. are going to feel a little bit sore the next day, mm -hmm. especially when you're just starting out. I know mm. I was sore for three, I four days. I don't know. I don't, like, ooh, not to brag. So good. But... Not seven days, but just like three <laughs> yeah. or four. Okay, oh, okay. <laughs> um, what about like, um, what would you recommend? So for like food wise and stuff and like recovery, I mean, even like yeah. you told me after we did like some workouts, you're like, Hey girl, like there's some magnesium. Mm. So, so kind of go into that as well. Like food yeah. and nourishment. Things so like obviously that. like recovery is a major part of the like working out. Mm -hmm. It's like, I would say like 70% of your workout. So first of all, like take your time to recover, especially if you've like done your class, if this was your first class, yeah. <clears throat> take your time to recover. You will feel the pain. I'm yeah. telling you <laughs> like your abs. Mm. Uh, but um, yeah, just take your time and just, you know, have some rest. And like also regarding food, it's just for me, like personally, I don't restrict in anything. 
it's for me it's just like you know replenish in order to mm-hmm. be able to you know perform better right so especially like if you sweat a lot mm-hmm. electrolytes are obviously a big thing Electrolytes. Are very important. Got exactly. <laughs> Writing those down. So yeah. <laughs> so if you love coconut water, amazing. So if you sweat a lot, coconut water has a lot of like potassium, mm-hmm. a lot of magnesium, calcium. So oh. yeah, just like it's amazing for your like skin, for your yeah. hair and everything. So if you love cocoa water, amazing. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> magnesium, obviously, if you like have it in a capsule or yeah. just like if you put it in your what's the word I'm looking for? You know the like if you put it in a sparkling, not sparkling, you know when you put a tablet in your water? Water bottle? No, no, no. <laughs> you know the, magne- is the, the, word the, mag- you know the no. magnesium, like you have it in like magnesium direct and you also yeah. put it like to dissolve in your in uh-huh, the water. Dis- okay, yeah. This is the word I was looking for, dissolve, yeah. Dissolve. <laughs> so yeah, magnesium is so awesome. important. Yeah. And yeah, eat, you yeah. know, eat. eat in order to be able to perform. Obviously, like don't restrict yourself on anything. No, yeah. You obviously need protein, you need carbs, you need fat. Yeah. So, do you hear that, people? Protein, carbs, fats. Do yeah. not avoid these. Like for real. Like they're yeah, so it is. important. Yeah. Because like there's a big, you know, conspiracy thing. against carbs and fats. It's, it's just so funny. It like kills me. I know. It it's like me. for me, people are we still stuck in the, I don't know, like 1990s when Atkins was, you know, a big thing. Huge. Yeah. Yeah. And it's just like it's obviously proven to not not be. It, you know, it's not as cool. like sustainable and yeah. not as good as yeah. you would think it was. You know, carbs so, are like your energy. So is from essential. That. Like, and nowadays, you know, like you have so many different options you know like good carbs like yeah s- not that any of them are bad but yeah. just like you know, sweets. yeah but like my favorites are just like sweet potato you have like oatmeal Perfect, you can yeah. have your i don't know potato amazing yeah. oh, love a good potato i mean i love a good pasta like I'm not oh gonna lie. i know like, i just love i was pasta. never never <laughs> honestly a big pasta type yeah i was always more pizza Ooh, okay. for me it's like pizza pizza, mm. pizza is great and you can it's have so good, good fats protein and right? your carbs on that like it exactly. is the perfect it's meal people so like, balanced put bananas on it get yeah. your potassium bananas <laughs> <laughs> but um yeah just like don't restrict and like yeah. i usually like if i have like an early class in the morning Let's say like six or seven a.m. Maybe if I'm not as hungry, then I'll have you know like a banana. Yeah. <laughs> a banana yeah. The return of the banana. Yeah. It's like just thread it throughout Coming our entire back conversation. To the bananas. I love bananas because like you can make banana bread. You can like <laughs> banana ice cream, yeah. banana gelato, <laughs> banana milkshake. I like, do love banana yeah. gelato. Good ice cream, like an yeah. ice cream. Mm. We love that. Um, maybe I should have one after this. Mm, yeah. Um, so yeah, usually after a class, I'll have. So I'm, I'm most mostly vegetarian mm-hmm. but let me tell you like if I come to the seaside you know like in like in on the Adriatic coast like people are really proud of how they make their fish that's true yeah so yep. if I see like a good grilled fish mm-hmm. can't resist it is good yeah so yeah, yeah I'm mostly vegetarian so like for breakfast I'll have like eggs with avocado or just like toast I'll have you know if I have my morning class like a really early morning class like 6 or 7 a.m. Then if I'm not as hungry, then I'll have a banana or, you know, with like peanut butter or, yeah. you know, normal, bananas. Yeah. Bananas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> After class, I'll have my breakfast. I love a good breakfast. So yeah. for me, it's either like oatmeal or banana ice cream. <laughs> 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 Literally, I love good bananas. <laughs> um, or I'll have like eggs with avocado and Perfect. toast. You just know. like, mm. And that's, I mean, you have your fats, yeah. you have your protein and you have of your course. carbs right there. So that's yeah. so perfect. And then for lunch, I'll usually have like either a sandwich or like a big salad. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm a big snack person. So okay. I'll have Ooh. a lot of snacks, yeah. like a protein bar. I love these like vegan, they're called Misfits vegan Ooh. bars. They're yeah. so nice. So I'll have one a day for sure. Yeah. And then, yeah. And then for dinner, I think I'll do, like, I'll usually do like a bigger dinner because I finish usually late. And mm-hmm. then like my classes are, let's say from five until like nine. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, I'll have like a big dinner with like a sweet potato bowl or... Ooh, nice. So nice, very nice. nice. Mm-hmm. With like tofu, oh, spinach. Mm. Love that. Oh, right? I love good spinach. Like good I'm combo. on such a or spinach salmon. kick right now. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. Right, and with avo. Mm, love that. Avo. I know. Love Lies that avo. As well. mm, when avo. you find a good avo in the store. Right. It's just like it hits so your right. day is already better. Right. I'm just like I am blessed. Yeah. Like. A good avo a day saves the day. <laughs> avo and bananas. <laughs> oh yeah, bananas. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Mm. Mm. Um, so of course, like whenever it comes to social media, TikTok, you see all of these trends and blah, blah, blah. Mm. Um, but the biggest one that I keep saying, and I don't know if it's because my algorithm or what, but you know, it is a trending thing. Pilates. Like yeah. Pilates are trending. Everybody is jumping yeah. on the Pilates bandwagon. Mm-hmm. 
Why are they so hot right now? What's that? Hey, oh wait. What's like, that one movie? So like, um, what's his face? So hot right now. Hunch will. One. So Ooh, hot right now. I don't know that one. Why do I know that it's one? It's a Zoolander. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. yeah, yeah. oh my god. I haven't it's seen hot. it as many it's times. Pilates. <laughs> so hot right now. You know. But um, but it is hot right now. Yeah, why do you? It is. Why do you think that is? I think like Pilates, you know, has been existent for years. And as I said, yeah. you know, like. From my point of view, I feel like before you used to think that like women 50 plus would do it. So in my head, it was like, it was when I was younger, it was like, it's gymnastics. It's, uh -huh. you know, like gymnastics oh, wow. for like, you know, older people. Yeah. Because you were saying the reformer machine, machines, yeah. right? Okay. Now, yeah. like now in like recent, like let's say 10 mm -hmm. years, reformer has like... Faded a little bit. Yeah, and it's it has. Matte Pilates. Yeah. I also yeah. feel like that. I don't know if it's the yeah. same thing with my TikTok. But I feel like a lot of people do reformer, but yeah. still, like, I feel like now with, like, COVID and with quarantine, I think it did, like, I think quarantine did, like, Pilates a huge, not a favor, but um, it helped, you know, Pilates get, like, the spotlight yeah. that it needed. Yeah. Because, yeah. like, you know, people were at home mm -hmm. who were quarantined. Yeah. People were either walking, they didn't mm -hmm. have, you know, like machines at home, most of the people. Yeah. Like, they didn't have a lot of equipment. Exactly. And then I wanted, then they, like, wanted to work out. So I feel like YouTube and like online workouts, online Pilates, for me, I did a lot of Pilates in yeah. quarantine. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I feel like this was the time where like people really got like into it and they were like, oh my God, this works. Yeah. And I was like, really? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. You, it does. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I feel like since then, I feel a lot of people, a lot of girls, a lot of clients yeah. tell me they've done a lot of, you know, Pilates in Aww. quarantine and then they yeah, loved it and um, yeah. That's great. I feel like yeah. this this was like the big the big like Pilates comeback. Yeah, yeah, because comeback. It was, it was yeah. popular for a bit and then it faded. Yeah, before yeah. exactly. Yeah. You know, like you know when you used to see those women in eighties. I think it was eighties, yeah. right? You yeah. know the leggings, the shiny. Oh my god! Those outfits, if you don't right? think I'm gonna like work out in that one, <laughs> if day, you don't like, think we'll do like a theme class, eighties. <laughs> oh my god! Like a headband. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Join uh, us at home. You know, send yeah. us your pictures. You know, <laughs> let us see you. Let us. No, see I love that. Yeah, um, I feel like this is so powerful. It is. It really like I'm really excited that it truly is. It leaves you feeling like that glow, which is just. It really if you've is. done a class or two, you know what I'm talking about. If you haven't, please do. <laughs> Try it. Yeah. yeah. Because like even after, you know, and it's, you know, Pilates isn't just like female specific, mm -hmm. of course. Like no matter what, like anybody can do Pilates. Yeah. Um, but I just feel Pilates <laughs> for me personally, I feel like I'm more in my feminine. And like it I feel is. kind of that divine glow afterwards. Exactly. And I just feel very, because I feel like, you know, it, I feel powerful physically. Mm -hmm. I feel powerful mentally and emotionally. Yeah. Um, and it just really brings about a sense of power. And so I hope Pilates yeah. isn't just a trend. You know, I hope, you know, I also hope in a so, year you know, or two, it doesn't I've, fall off. Yeah, I think know? it's just like, for me, like, if I follow a trend, then it's just something that's temporary. Exactly. You know? Like, if you realize that you love something, then it's long term. Yeah, you know? exactly. And a lot of, like, as you said, like your feminine side, but like a lot of girls <clears throat> are still very surprised because in my studio, obviously, I have women's locker room uh -huh. and men's locker room. And yeah. they're like, oh my God, you have men's locker room. And I'm like, yeah, a lot of guys love Pilates yeah, because absolutely. like even my like, my fiance, uh -huh. when I became a, a teacher, he was, I was like, please come to my class. Please come Aww. to my class. And he's like, well, Mia, what am I going to do there? Like all the girls. And then when he, exactly, exactly. I mean, a lot of guys would be happy. Yeah. Um, but um, yeah, he loved it. He oh, literally awesome. loved it at, at first and he's been doing it since. And that's yeah. Great. What a supportive partner you have. Right? Like, good job. I know. He's my like, like listen, experimental she's person. Pilates coach has a supportive partner. I know. Like, <laughs> right. So, yeah, but like he's my Aww. like experimental person. If I need That's to do cool. like a new class, I'm like, come here, let me hey try babe. this. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah try this so real quick. It That's is, but great. it also brings like your feminine side and just like, absolutely. Yeah, it leaves you feeling very like strong, empowered. It does. It's yeah, what it empowered. Should be, you know? I just feel so empowered. Right. And not just with your class, but even like the ones with the in the app, like just yeah. using those as well. Like of uh, course, we have some that range from like 16 minutes, you know, 15, 16 minutes, to some to 20, 25 yeah. minutes. But so even it's just like. But even those short ones, like just the exercises you go right. through and that it's circuit just like training, 50 minutes. I'm just like, oh my gosh, like mm -hmm. I feel so good. I'm yeah. happy. Like I'm, the ones in the app are more like heat, heat Pilates. Yeah, so I would say, yeah, you know, yeah, like, yeah. You have like tennis exercises in like few rounds. Exactly. And um, I feel like those are very good if you have like, for me, like this is the like 
the best workout that I can have in like 15 minutes. Yeah. You yeah, know, yeah, like yeah. 15 to 20 your minutes. your heart rate is up. Yeah. Like you're, you're moving. You're exactly. grooving. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You'll feel the burn. You feel the burn, party people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's awesome. Come on, party awesome. people. Yeah. Um, um, so, yeah, I feel like this is, you know, like if you have 15 minutes in a day. You no. Know, amazing time to spend it that's so good you know. yeah yeah. <laughs> yeah and those uh they're also a part of the like in the app we also have those in our for you plan so your coach will send you exercises and those are all tailored to your cycle as well um mia has created those uh for all phases of the cycle and so once you start following your plan you will see pilates throughout of it whether you're in follicular sometimes in your fertile window luteal i just don't put them in period because i yeah. really you know, ladies, like sometimes we can, sometimes we can't during our period have, and, have your rest. you know, just have your rest. So <laughs> don't even worry about that. But otherwise, I mean, you, like yeah. we have all of them for every phase. Exactly. Um, and I just, I love yeah. that. I think that's so wonderful that you can that's perform good. them throughout the cycle. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah, you can. You really can. Like any time of your cycle. And if you feel like not, just don't, don't do, do it. it. Yeah. yeah. You easy know. as that. Yeah. It's, Take it's that easy, easy, honey. Yeah. 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 Just stretch yeah. for five minutes. Yeah. Go for a walk. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's yeah, awesome. Yeah. So, girl, tell me, like, what's your favorite class? I mean, I have mine. Yeah. Like, if you had to choose, like, it's, is it core? Is it, okay, so is it core? Is it booty? Uh-huh. Is it abs? Uh -huh. So, like, just abs. Is it Honest, legs? It's it's all of them. It's full hey. body. I love yeah. the full body classes. Mm -hmm. I feel, just because, so, sometimes, like, I do something with my right hand, I feel like mm -hmm. I need to do it with my left hand. Yeah. <laughs> like, it's a little weird, like, um, thing about me. Yeah. Um, and so... <laughs> so <Old city. laughs> yeah. And so I love, like, um, you know, when we work the legs, work the glutes, work mm. the core, work the upper body. I just love the full body, I know. you know, like, it I just, know. It, I love it. You feel the um, stream of energy. I do, and I feel mm -hmm. it all over my body. Um, mm -hmm. My legs, I have really strong legs. You know, mm -hmm. I played soccer growing up. Lucky you. Um, thank you. Yeah. Thank mm. you. And so I know I should do more upper body workouts and stuff yeah. my shoulders are very weak you so whenever feel, yeah. we do I do feel it you mm. know and so whenever I'm you know we're in those classes and stuff yeah. and whenever I'm working out with the app like I do feel like I need to work my shoulders my upper body more but it's like very common with women it's just like with us women it's um like our upper body is usually weaker okay you know yeah. guys have a lot easier time building up upper body muscles that's true yeah I've been it working really these is. arms for years and they still I shake I know like. it's still a struggle for me too <laughs> like some workouts are still you know when I do it in the app as well yeah. I'm just like if I'm doing this at home, okay, but yeah. now I need to look a certain way, so it yeah. does, you know, it, uh, I do feel it still. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's normal, you know, yeah. so maybe like, yeah, just, this is, I think, like, a beautiful thing about Pilates, because like, you can do whichever parts of the body you want, yeah. Yeah, yeah. you know, and you can literally feel when you like, put your mind into it, oh, you can yeah. literally feel like, what's weaker, what's, you know, yeah, what and should then I you work think on? about it, yeah. Yeah, and so right now, like, my focus for, you know, like, as do we say in the goal? business. Yeah, do you have a I goal? Yeah, I do. I do have a goal. Like, do you have a workout that you want to succeed? So, I want to strengthen my upper body. Mm. Like, uh, okay. you know, I want those... I know what we're doing uh, in our <laughs> oh, next no. class. No. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah. no. <laughs> um, but I want those, you know, Jennifer Aniston, mm -hmm. like arms, mm -hmm. you know, and like mm -hmm. those shoulders. She's just very defined. Yeah. And it's really beautiful. And I know she also uses weights and stuff. And we use weights yeah, sometimes in class. Mm -hmm. Um, but I really want to, like, define my upper arms. I have, like, these little things right here. My family, we call them chicken oh, nuggets. Oh, my God. They're beautiful. I love them. I think oh, they're so cute. Them. You yeah. know? My I partner do. sometimes <laughs> grabs at them. Yeah. <laughs> you know? I'm like, great. No, but they're Macy beautiful. They get you yeah. stronger. They do. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And so, like, you know, just working this, like, is wonderful. But if I had to yeah. choose, like, I would always say, like, you know, I want to do full, full body. body. Okay. Of course. But when it comes down to it, if I had to, like, choose a second or choose something, like, what's yeah. best for me, I would probably say, okay, let's do some upper body because, yeah. Yeah. Because, you know, I feel like people have different goals of, like, different perceptions on, you know, their workouts. Some Absolutely. people have different goals on what they want to achieve, you know? Oh, yeah. Um, so, like, whether it's getting stronger, whether it's getting, you know, more, like, fit or getting your, like, cardio right. part, yeah, you know? exactly. Yes, um, all of it. Yes. Yeah, but for me, it was the same thing. Like, I was the same thing. I had such weak arms. I was yeah. like, I want to build those arms. Yeah. You I want to be able to do, like, a, a chin-up, yeah. you know? Or, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. be able to perform, like, your everyday life better. Better, exactly. You know? No, exactly. Pilates that. gets you stronger for your everyday life, right? I like that. Right. Let's say it one more time for the people in the back. So, uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> mic check, mic Pilates. check. <laughs> so, Pilates gets you stronger for your everyday life, people. I love that.
I love Thank that. you. And it Thank does. Girl. It really it does. It really does, right? Yeah. 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 I mean, I already... Just like... I mean, I feel it, you know, whenever going. I just, like, do anything. Mm -hmm. You know, when people. I'm, like, straightening my hair, my arm's not as always Yeah. Hard, you know? <laughs> you just think about those triceps. Just, I just mm, those triceps, mm. which it's, like, preparing me for, like, yeah. when I'm getting ready and, like, watching my hair, you know? When you have to shampoo twice. I know. My arms are tired, you know? I feel the strength, you know? <laughs> I know. I know. It's just, like, it's marvelous. But it is marvelous, right? and yeah. it is awesome because it really does, like you know work in everyday yeah. life and, and stuff. I'm so happy that like yeah. people realized how like good it is absolutely yeah. my mom has been doing it for years and like I feel I feel like I, I'm the teacher and like she could be like teaching me because oh, wow. she's been doing it you know for a long time oh, cool. and I've been doing it for like two and a half years and I'm like so Pilates runs in your family okay. yeah exactly <laughs> cool yeah it's genetic <laughs> yeah my mom's usually like either mad Pilates with me mm -hmm. or like reformer Pilates cool um but yeah, I'm like, am I late to this trend? Or is yeah. my mom just like very early yeah. on this trend? You she's know? an OG. She's known. She's right. known mm -hmm. all her life. She was one of those girls actually in the uh, leg in warmers the leg. and I the know. one piece. I know. I know. Yeah. I was just like thinking about it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, so yeah, yeah. like with the crazy letter like, with the like curly hair. Just like hair, hair yeah. 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 And the With earrings. speaker yeah. and the <laughs> microphone <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> Let's go, ladies. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. In three, <laughs> two. <laughs> That's I awesome. do say that sometimes. You say it all the time, right? especially in the app. Like, um, so I we did have people reach out and like talk yeah. about like just certain like um, little things that they mm -hmm. loved about like yeah. your classes and stuff. And they're like, okay. in three, two, one, let's, let's go. go. Yeah. You know, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I do do and they're like, there's no break. <laughs> like, where is my break? I'm like, no, it's there. You're just like, yeah. you're really getting after it. Yeah. You know? And yeah. they're just like, oh, okay, let's go. But, so it's awesome. Yeah. So yeah, party the people really in three, two, people. one, let's go. Yeah. Like, yeah. Party people. Party people. Mm -hmm. That's it. That's mm -hmm. it's the best one. Yeah. 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 Love it. Love. But yeah. So like when like what was your first class? Do you remember which class was your first one that you uh, did in the app? app yeah. Right. Um. It was actually the full body. The full body. Full body one, of yeah. course. Yeah. <laughs> full I know. Body forever. Full body girl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But um, yeah. How was like your How was your first class? Like, was it? Did you find it like as a? Did you like? Would you Would you consider yourself a beginner or just like? Oh, I'm absolutely a beginner. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Um. I'm total novice because yeah. I'm still learning and I'm still trying to get like my form down and I'm trying sure. to basically build up my stamina. Mm -hmm. uh, what I noticed with that class when I first started it was, you know, after about 10 minutes, you know, I really started feeling it like hardcore in my body, you yeah. know? And then you were like, all right, warm up's over. And I was like, <laughs> okay, okay. Oh. <laughs> like, oh, okay. Love it. Um, <laughs> Love that look. It's just yeah. like full of hope. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> like, literally. Where's this girl's, like, yeah, where's this like, girl's stop button? <laughs> this isn't the workout. Um, but no, I realized like mostly in my stamina and yeah. like, I feel like the power in my... <laughs> What did you find, little girl? I don't, she found something. She I'll found let her go. Paper, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Um, Zoe. 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 Daddy Turita. Come on here. Come on. Um, hmm. But what I noticed, yeah, definitely my stamina, like, definitely was just skyrocketed. Yeah. Uh, I'm able to get through more of the routine. And the fact that I'm able to complete the routine at like a moderate pace, mm -hmm. that's a total success for me because I was slowing down and you're like, okay, just 10 more seconds and I'm already like, Lying on the mat I know, a little those bit. last 10 seconds lost a minute. I they know. do. <laughs> I know, I know. Always. For me as well sometimes, you know. Yeah. Like when I do a class, when I teach a class, you know, like you as a teacher, you obviously know that you can stop sometimes, you know. Mm -hmm. Like if you're a student, like you, well, you can, but you won't, you know, you won't stop. Can have that pressure on, your, on yourself. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So like uh, sometimes, you know, when I do a class, like a full class, if I go like, you know, do a certain class somewhere, I'm like when I do a full 60 minute or like, 30 or 45 minutes, I'm like, oh my God, I usually used to stop at this point because you, you <laughs> yeah, used to yeah. burn, but that's now these last 10 yeah. seconds are just, you know, but yeah, that's, you know. Less than seconds, last a minute, mm -hmm. yeah. But mm -hmm. I just love that I'm able to go through the class now and yeah. instead of, you know, I don't focus so much now on, you know, the amount, the exactly. quantity, rather than the quality of exactly. it. Exactly. And so I take it a little bit slower sometimes, mm -hmm. um, but you know, when I'm in my fertile window, I'm able to really keep up well just sure. because I do have a bit more energy, you know, it's just how my body, like how the body is during a yeah. fertile window, you know, exactly. you get that explosion of energy. Um, but once I like start going into luteal, especially during PMS, yeah. I definitely take it slower and I focus a lot more on just the quality of it and my exactly. form and just really focus especially on Especially like at that time, you know, like 
obviously bigger muscles like spend a lot more energy absolutely so at yeah. this time you know it's nice to do like a core day or just like yeah. arms and um yeah i mean that's that's amazing it's amazing and thank I you for that it. like I love these it. Thank and these workouts you. and, and anyway, the apps are wonderful like, yeah oh, this is what no pilates is all about it's just like control and just like quality mm -hmm. and don't rush it take it easy yeah. everything will come enjoy it time. listen exactly. to your body please enjoy yeah. and be consistent exactly yeah. the three tips yeah oh yeah. <laughs> well mia thank you so much for coming thank on our you. podcast well, thank you so much thank you for having me Absolutely. this was amazing this i could was see you amazing the whole thing. <laughs> oh, we will after we right? close this yeah. off yeah <laughs> So guys, if you want to see more of Mia, you can see her in the app. Of course, you're going to find her in Coach, and you'll see her on our socials. And yeah, that's awesome. Yeah. So thank you so I much. I hope we'll see you on your mats. <laughs> yeah, see you, you on the mat. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for having me. This was amazing. And yeah, I hope I helped. You did. Yeah. You did. Oh, my you God. Did. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> So guys, in honor of the new Pilates in our app, we are giving away an IV. Uh -huh. Yes, yes. <laughs> we are giving away an IV, which comes with a six month subscription to Coach. So you can check out all of the Pilates in there and more. Uh, all you have to do is leave a review, leave a comment under whatever you're watching or listening to this podcast on, just say a little something, interact with us, and then take a screenshot of it and email it to podcast at bellabeat.com. And we will have a drawing to choose a winner very soon. And we'll contact you and let you know if you won or not. Well, if you didn't win, we won't tell you. So that's okay. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's normal. Um, but yeah, just leave a review, leave a comment, screenshot, and send it to podcast at bellabeat.com. Until next time. Choo! Ciao! <laughs> <laughs>